Ora la parola alla collega Cecilia Wirstrom della Commissione Peti. Thank you very much. Mr. Navrasic, I am not completely satisfied or convinced with your replies to the question put by my colleagues, given the fact that during the last decade you have been one of the principal architects of the current Hungarian administration as a parliamentary group leader and then senior minister in the Fidesz government, which has come under intense international criticism for politicizing judiciary, limiting the fundamental rights of citizens, and attacking NGOs. Now you're proposed to be the European Commissioner for Citizenship. Your answers clearly point out that you are a very skillful politician. But Mr. Navrasic, I can assure you, so are we. We can read you perfectly well. As the chairman of the Petitions Committee, the only committee in this House dealing directly with citizens and their rights, I would like to know how you imagine having a fruitful cooperation with an institution such as the European Parliament, which stands up for the same freedoms that your government have worked so vigorously against. And I look forward to your answer. Grazie. Let me thank you for mentioning the public administration reform because it is one of the huge achievements of the recent Hungarian government. It is a reference work in the OECD as well, actually. On the other hand, as a reform of the, of the judiciary in Hungary, and, and it's in the Justice Scoreboard, which is published by the European Commission this year, this spring, the feeling of the independence of judiciary or the list of the feeling of the independence of judiciary. Uh, Hungary's place was the 72nd in 2011, and it is 66 in 2013. That means that the feeling became stronger, the feeling of the independence of the judiciary. On the other hand, the trust in judiciary, uh, the EU average is 53%, the Hungarian result is 58%. That means that the Hungarians are more trusted in the, in the judiciary and they have a, a more trust in the judiciary than the EU average. I think uh, those, are, those are results and you have to take into account when you make an opinion about the, about the policy changes in Hungary. But on the other hand, and the question, the essence of the question is, was are possible cooperation in the future. And I think that we have to cooperate closely and I'm ready to, to work with you very closely because you are one of the representatives of the European citizens and I, hopefully, I will be one of the member of the European Commission which is responsible for the citizenship, for the culture, education, all other uh, portfolios which you have uh, opinions and feedbacks from the citizens.